morning, Hans. It is Sunday. <laughs> it is Sunday morning. Yeah. Yeah. Um, I woke up. I woke up like at 3. And I got up. I had to use the bathroom and get some water and my usual routine stuff. Um... That that thought just <laughs> I went back to bed and I did not get back up until eight. Yeah. Mm. Anywho, um, when I came in the kitchen, I didn't really have enough dishes last night to do the dishwasher, so I didn't turn it on. But when I came into the kitchen, everybody's breakfast dishes were piled in the sink, and they're midnight snack dishes were piled in the sink. So, I did something that my future self will thank me for. I didn't grumble, I didn't gripe, I didn't complain. I just slowly started before I even had my coffee. I thought, you know what, before I get my coffee, I'm going to clean this sink. So, I loaded the dishwasher, I turned it on, and then I got my coffee. So yeah, so that was something my future self will thank me for. I you think I even turned it on, and there is Fat Man. Hey guys. He's been to the Honey Bun House. The Honey Bun Heifers. The Honey Bun Heifers. Did you see your main heifer? Mm-hmm. He's got his girlfriend there. Mm -hmm. What's her name? Cindy. Cindy is his girlfriend. Mm -hmm. She's the main honey bun heifer. Oh, let me roll out your way. Okay, I'm trying to make my way to where I've got um, my great niece that is due any moment. My sister said that her daughter-in-law, her skins cannot stretch no more. She does not see how that poor girl can go another week. But uh, the doctor's like, yeah, another week, it'll be fine. And poor Laura, the mom, you know, the pregnant mama, she's like, no, it won't. <laughs> I mean, they said her skin has stretched to the point, it, it ain't stretching no more. So, but we're on baby watch. I've got to clean out some of my baby stuff I had from Alice Marie. I had told my sister not to worry about buying stuff um, in order to have stuff at her house for the baby. I've got an extra saucer, I've got a pack and play, um, you know, things like that. So, but I am going to get together the blanket that I crocheted her, a couple of little outfits that I did not make but that I have, like some little onesies and stuff. I never got around to making her a dress. Just never got around to it. These are too swollen. Yeah. I just can't. So, but I am going to start getting her stuff together. And, and this is not sponsored in any way. Not sponsored. But if y'all have never tried the fast fixing country fried steaks from Sam's, oh my stars in heaven, they are wonderful. One, they're huge. You actually get 10 patties in here, and you would think, eh, but they're like, seriously, this big. Okay? So, whenever I made them, I made enough for like everybody to have two because yeah I, I, one I never know how many people are gonna be in and out two um yeah I didn't know <laughs> um so that's why I made some of them I had two of them frozen in here with the gravy on it and I was able to separate them and get them like that. I don't know how that one's going to do with the gravy on it. But I did not throw it away. No, we don't throw food away in this house. We freeze it. 
um, yeah, it'll be fine. If it's a little soggy, I'll eat it. Um, and it even comes with two packets of the country gravy mix. Like what we, we down here call it sawmill gravy. Um, it's peppered, but it's not spicy. Um, this is the only kind of white sawmill gravy that I like. Um, usually I just, no, I'm not a fan. Mm -mm, no, 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 no. But, um, it even gives you the recipe on the back on how to make southern style biscuits. Because there's something about a country fried steak biscuit. You know what I'm saying? Um, yes ma'am. Yes, ma'am. But yeah, yeah. If you have a Sam's membership, try them. They are they are truly worth having in your freezer for just one of those quick go-to easy meals. Um, like I said, I'm either going to do some instant mashed potatoes or mac and cheese, or I might even just open up a can of corn. I got some corn up here. And, um, I mean, we could make this super simple. I know I don't want to do whole potatoes because they're on, my, they're on the menu for later in the week. And I do need to sit down and do my menu plan now that I've gone through the freezers. Okay, I think we're going to do corn to go with it. Yeah. Corn it is. Corn it shall be. Okay. Hey, honestly, it is still Sunday evening now. And usually on Sundays, we have what we call yo-yo supper. You're on your own. Um, we just got in from the pool. Uh, yeah, we had fun. We all went... And so, we had fun, and once the girls got out, then I stayed in, and Fat Man turned on, on and off the hose while I vacuumed. It's, it's no big, because the water is so good for me. I can move in that water, and it not hurt. And so, I did my physical therapy while I was in the water, and, oh, it was wonderful. But now I'm paying the price because my leg is about to drive me insane. But we did get it vacuumed out. And tonight we are taking a page out of Jordan Page's um, Fun Cheaper Free Shelf Cooking. Um, and you can do the hashtag Shelf Cooking. Uh-oh, there we go. Um, and find it. And I told that man I needed to go through the freezers, through the um, fridge, through the pantry. You start with your fridge first because you want to use your fresh produce and anything that's going to go bad quickly. You want to use it first. Then you go through your freezers. You want to use up that. And then you can go to your shelves. Um... And you make your menu from that. Well, we wound up, we had little bitty pieces and parts. You know, like a little bit of this. I think there's only one. One or two left in this huge bag. I got this huge bag taking up space in my freezer. And there's only one or two in it. So, that's what we're doing tonight. We are so close to the end of the month. Um, I think there's only one chicken patty in here. Um, Carol Beth had decided we need to call this mystery meat. I cannot remember if it's beef or if it's pork. It, we did barbecue with it. Or we cooked it like a roast. And I intended to do barbecue. This is where you always mark what it is. I need to learn from my own lessons, don't I? And then here, if you notice, is another in the glad bag. It's another pack of chicken patties. 
There are two open packages. Do you see the problem? <laughs> so, I'm just kind of going through and I'm getting the odds and ends out. And that's what we're doing for supper. We're going to figure out what we can make and what we don't use tonight. Then guess what? We'll have it tomorrow night. And I'm going to kind of figure out and make my menu from this. Yeah. Yeah, that's, that's how we're going to roll. Uh, there comes Batman. Carol Beth said she wanted a country fried steak. So she's got dibs and claims on that. I am thinking, see again, I did not mark. Um, this is the Swiss steak that we had um, with the country gravy and the mushrooms. Um, and this is some of the country fried steak with sawmill gravy. Like this. So, and that's how we're going to do it. Right, Fat Man? Right. You have fun in that pool, Fat Man? We did. We had a good time. Okay, so, but dig through your freezers. Pick, well, especially like toward the end of the month or before you get ready to go to the grocery store. Especially before you get ready to go to the grocery store. You really want to, you know, dig through. You know you've got those glad bags of something in your freezer that you could do something with. Um... And figure out meals that you can make from stuff that you got that you need to use. Um, like the chicken fried patty things. Um, let's see. There's three in here. There's, oh, there's three in here. Woof, woof. Um, we can either do chicken sandwiches, which I've got those 19 cent a pack hamburger buns. I got it all day the other week and put in the freezer. So we can either do chicken sandwiches or we can do chicken parmesan. Um, yeah, yeah. Um, with this meat and this meat, I'm seeing barbecue. I'm just saying. I'm just seeing barbecue. Um, I got the steak, cube steak stuff. We can just kind of heat up, throw it over rice or mashed potatoes. Boom, there you go. There's the meal. So that's three meals right there. That's three nights um, that are taken care of. Right, Batman? Right. So dig through your freezers, find and use things that you need to use before you go to the store and buy more. You feel better after that swim? Yep. It's been raining now. Oh, good. Well, I'm glad we got our swim in. He always feels better after he gets out of the pool. Mm -hmm. Well, all right. So tie your bows. Wiggle your nose. <laughs> that was Samantha. I guess Ta Yeah, well Tabitha wiggled her nose too. To make it happen, didn't she? Yeah, Tabitha did. Anyhow. I was trying to be like Dr. Seuss. <laughs> you still could just rhyme. Uh, so, but yeah, I think tonight we're going to do the country fried steak and probably just a quick side. I'll probably do my fallback go-to is either instant mashed potatoes or mac and cheese. One of those.